Light Warriors. It's Bella Bashan here. So the Holy Spirit. Switch from Dish and get up to $300 in reward cards. Hello, Light Warriors. It's Bella Bashan here. So the Holy Spirit was letting me know that their soul just about fell through their pants when they saw you pass them or surpass them or the last became first and the first became last. So this message is related to being on the SEAL squad for God, like being like a Navy SEAL. And this message is also inspired by David Goggins. So I'm a, I'm a big David Goggins fan and I read his first book. I think he has a new book out, but if you guys haven't um, been inspired by him, you might very well be very inspired by David Goggins. But something he, something um, David Goggins would say when I was like reading his book and listening to his speeches, he, see David Goggins, he is a bad bleep, you guys. Like this guy is so inspiring. He, he has overcome a lot to become in the, like the seat where he is it didn't come for him easily when he um got into the the navy seal squad he had to do it like more than one time which is i relate to that a lot like i've had to, i had to take my ged more than one time i had to take my esthetician's license like i've had to like overcome things and do things more than once and not give up and the Holy Spirit wants us to have that mindset of not giving up because that's what it takes to be on a SEAL squad or be on the SEAL squad for God. We have to be tough. We have to have that tough mindset. How do you think those guys make it through the, that, that SEAL training camp? If they were weak in their mind, if all they wanted to do was give up and quit, for what they felt like was punishment that they were going through, but it's actually training so that they can serve a higher purpose, just like what you're being put through. You're being put through what it may feel like hell and back. You may feel like you're being tortured and it's like you're gonna be this elite bad bleep when you get done, just like you're gonna be on the SEAL squad for God. And I'm, I'm supposed to tell you guys one of the ways I personally address God in my relationship with God is God, like, I say yes, sir. Like, that's the type of relationship I have. A lot of the times I address God by sir. There are moments when I call God Father and the, the, the God of hosts, the God that protects us. But a lot of the times God will have me saying, yes, sir. And so when God gives us, when God tells us something to do, that's the response he wants. He wants us to say, yes, sir. It's not, he's not asking us. He's, he's, it's an order in Jesus's mighty name. So I want you guys to know you are taking souls. Like David Goggins says, you are out there and you are doing your darn thing. You are really doing it. You are doing this boot camp and you are having the mindset. You are overcoming these big obstacles and you have people wondering, dude, that, that person is like, that person's a maniac. That person's like, you know, I was going to say beast, but we don't want to use that word, but you know, like a beast for God, like in the best type of way, like you're hardcore for the guts, for the seal squad, for God. And God wants us to give us his yes, sir, and to keep going. Do not give up. This is this is nothing to play with. So I love you guys. I hope this word blesses you and motivates you. Give it a thumbs up if it did. Subscribe to see more videos, and I'll talk to you again later. Well done, Bashan.